what's going on guys welcome back to another video so today's video is going to be a little something different it has nothing to do with jerseys or nothing like that i'm going to be attempting to restore some sneakers what kind of sneakers am i going to try to restore I'll try to restore these bad boys these are the nike sb classic black and whites these are the 2011 releases and i bought these like man i bought these when these first came out like when I was in high school, these were my first ever pair of dunks that I purchased, and I've done everything of these dunks. I freaking, freaking skated these, played basketball in these, hiked in these, went to work in these. Just I freaking wore these. I wore these bad boys down. Let me tell you. But these are such an amazing shoe. I just love dunks, guys. But yeah, these are my first ever pair of dunks that I purchased back in 2011. So I was like in 10th grade at the time. So. As you guys can clearly see, the shoe is just, I don't know if I can pick it up on camera, but it's completely yellow. And you guys can see there's some white still, but yeah, it's it's really deoxidized. Oops, almost dropped them. But yeah, I'm gonna see if I can attempt to bring these back to life because I honestly want to rock these again. I want to rock these. I want them to look fresh. I did clean the shoe up. It used to be way dirtier than this. The, like the Nike swoosh was like brown, it was dirty, but I did clean these shoes up. I didn't get to record because I was just, just trying to clean them up. But yeah, they're nice and black again. The suede is okay. So I'm going to see if I can bring the rubber back and see if it's going to... I don't know, man. I want to see if I can bring these... See if I can get them yellow. See if I can get them white again. So wish me luck. I'm going to show you guys what I'm about to do. Now, I did, I did do them on another pair of dunks. And I'll show you guys at the end of the video of what I did right there. So stay tuned, guys. all right guys so as you can clearly see out in the sun the shoes are hella yellow let's get this thing started and let's bring these bad boys back to life all right so you're only going to need a few things for this project a toothbrush, Salon Care 40, and plastic wrap. All right, so now we have our Salon Care 40 and we're gonna go ahead and just put just a little bit onto the sole. You wanna make sure you don't put too much because, well, this can get messy. And also too, you wanna make sure you be careful. You don't get this stuff onto the suede because you just don't know how your suede is going to react to the shoe. So yeah. As you can see, just go ahead and just brush all this stuff all over the shoe. Just make sure you get as much as you can. Again, just be careful you don't get it on the suede. Again, it it's, can be a little difficult, but as long as you guys have patience, you should pull this off, okay? So yeah, as you can see, I did get some on the sole, but luckily nothing happened. And yeah, all right, so. We're going to go ahead and get our plastic wrap. And well, again, I'm not a YouTuber like that, so I don't have any tripods. So I'm going to have to put the camera away and wrap the shoes. OK, so as you can see, wrap the shoes up, put them out in the sun. You guys want to make sure you only have these out here for a little bit, because, again, if you leave them out for too long, your soils can your soils, your soles can separate, unfortunately. So I recommend 30 to 40 minutes and we'll see where we go from there. All right, so after about two sessions, so far so good. They look pretty good. Now, I forgot to mention, you're probably gonna have to do more than one or two sessions depending on how white you wanna get these shoes. And as you can clearly see, there is a major difference. You can see how yellow they were compared to now. So unfortunately, the sun's already going down, so I'm gonna have to continue this project on to the next day. All right, so it is the next day and I'm doing the other side of the shoes now. I'm gonna do about a few sessions, like I said, and we'll go from there. And also too, I'm also gonna do the other side one more time. So that will be a complete three sessions because I'm trying to get these as wide as I can. You're not gonna get them factory wide, but hey, I'm trying to make them look as good as I can possibly can. All right, so after three sessions on each side, these are how the shoes look. And I have to say, they look really amazing. I'm ready to rock these. I mean, they're, 
they just look so cool. I'm very happy with the results. All right, so it is the next day. And after about a couple of sessions, I did about three sessions on each side. So they came out pretty well. Here they are. Much difference, guys. They, uh, I'm very, very impressed. I'm excited. Brought these bad boys back to life. I'm ready to rock these again. It's just a very big difference of when I first had them. You know, it was just all around, just yellow and beat. And now they look like a good pair of dunks. They don't look too brand new, but hey, it's okay. I'm ready to rock these again. I mean, of course, if you guys want to get your shoes to factory white or whatever you're trying to do, you got to do more sessions. But it took a lot of work, so I'm not going to lie. But hey, so, <coughs> excuse me. It's not COVID. Shut up. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I'm excited about these shoes. I'm excited about the results. So again, I'm ready to rock these. So I this is my attempt to bring you back some dunks. So you guys saw how yellow they were. So this is my attempt. And I should say they worked out pretty well. But again, you know, if no matter how white you want to get your shoes, you're going to have to do more sessions. But I did about three to get them this white. I can't go one more session to make them more and more white, but I'm, I'm probably going to end up using most of the bottle. So it's all good. I'm going to stick with these for a while. But yeah, guys, these are my 2011 classic black and white Nike SB Dunks. Brought them back to life from yellow to white. So hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope you guys... Uh, learn something from this at least i hope this was helpful but i mean again this is how i do it so but yeah see you guys in the next video peace out guys <laughs>